Welcome to WebShare Academy. I'll show you how to set up a single proxy on Android. Let's start. There are two methods to configure a proxy, one for browser traffic and one for all phone traffic. Method one. First, open settings on your Android device. Tap Wi-Fi and connect to your desired network. Then tap the Wi-Fi name or the settings icon next to it. Scroll down and tap Advanced Settings. Under Proxy, select Manual. Now, enter the proxy host name and port from your WebShare proxy list. Simply go to webshare.io. You can get 10 free proxies from WebShare by signing up. On the WebShare dashboard, open Proxy List. Choose a proxy and copy its IP address and port. Paste them into the fields. Some phones also let you bypass proxies for selected websites. This is optional. Next, open your WebShare dashboard. Select your authentication method, username slash password, or IP authentication. If using username slash password, enter your login details in the browser when prompted. If using IP authentication, whitelist your Android IP so you won't need to log in manually. That's it. You've set up a proxy for browser traffic. Method two. Now let's configure a proxy for all phone traffic. Open Google Play Store and install Super Proxy. Once installed, tap Open. Tap Add Proxy. Enter a profile name of your choice. Select the protocol type. We'll be using SOX5 for this setup. Enter the server IP, port, and your authentication details. For DNS resolution, choose proxy for better privacy. Then tap save and click start. Now you, all your phone's network traffic, including apps and browsers, runs through your proxy. To confirm, visit any IP checker website in your browser to ensure it's connected. That's it! You've successfully set up a proxy on Android. If you run into any issues, let us know in the comments and we'll help you.